We know from research that arts play a critical role in students' development, including skills such as critical thinking, problem solving, communication, teamwork, and creativity and innovation. This is why we at DT are excited to team up with UMS in honoring the Educator of the Year Award. So DT Energy has been pleased to honor educators and schools across Southeast Michigan in partnership with UMS all the way back since 2009. She doesn't know it's coming, it's a surprise to her, so I'm sure she's going to be very emotional when she gets down there. I'm from UMS, the University Musical Society, um, which is the Performing Arts Center at the University of Michigan. Recently, we learned about a mural project at your school, led by your art teacher, Lynn Settles. <laughs> Lynn, would you come on over? Ms. Settles worked with a local historian, Matt Siegfried, and led students in an exploration of the history of African American community in Ypsilanti, which included visits to local underground railroad stops and other places of importance to the community. And then the students designed and painted a mural under Ms. Settles guidance, which was dedicated to H.P. Jacobs, a slave who taught himself to read and write who forged his own identity papers and fled from Alabama coming to Ipsy before the Civil War. That, that first mural was such a great success that she is continuing the project. This is a wonderful combination of important local history, community building, and artistic inspiration, and it's why DTE and UMS are proud to honor Lynn Settles as one of the 2017 DTE Energy Foundation Educators of the Year. Congratulations to you. You know, she builds great relationships with her students. She is so passionate about the work that she does with her students, not only through art but in life. You know, she's done a lot of community murals uh, within Ypsilanti, but she's also helped to lead and drive some rallies for our students as well. Uh, when our students need something, they go to Miss Settles. They know that she's, you know, that they can trust Miss Settles and that she's someone that they can go to and be a rock for them in our school, and not only just our school but in our community. So I came to Ipsy about three years ago as a new teacher, but like a veteran teacher. And so most teachers, I um, had to get to know my students, so I asked them questions about Ypsilanti and different things like that. And one of the things that they mentioned is that they didn't go downtown very often, and they didn't know a lot, a whole lot about their African-American history connection to Ipsy. So that became like a mission for me. So um, I kind of reached out to the community and the community reached back and I presented it to the kids that we're going to do this mural and they showed up. <laughs> they showed up on the weekends, they showed up at night, they showed up for interviews, they showed up for after school, they showed up for <laughs> everything. <laughs> she's awesome and um, she's turned our art class into a family. Um, when I first sat down in Miss Settles' class, I didn't really talk to anyone. I was just sitting by myself. And I remember Miss Settles came up to me and said, Hi, what's your name? What do you do? Oh, that's awesome. She just talked to me like a best friend. And I remember I was completely dumbfounded that she actually cared. And like I, I remember coming in the next week, and she remembered exactly what I had said that day. And she actually listens to her students. And she's just amazing. Words, there are no words that have been written that I can describe. She's like the light that gives us all like the courage to do our best and keep on and everything. So it's just, it's like her second mom. Yeah, it's like a <laughs> second mom. When I first walked into the door, I felt the change and I felt the love in the room. And just meeting this beautiful person, like I said in the poster, watching this teacher take care of each individual person in just one year and get to know them is beautiful. Having a teacher like this at this school is just a great thing to have, and I hope that we have it for many more years. Mm. What I think is very special about teaching art, art reaches, it's another form of communications, and it has the ability to reach everyone, whether you speak English or whatever language you speak, you have the ability to communicate your thoughts, you have right to be different and it's okay to be different. Art in the schools is the reason some kids come to school. 
It is the reason some kids stay after school. They need art regardless of what they ever become professional artists. It, it is so much more than that. It, uh, it actually feeds the soul so much more than that.